Pokemon Legends EA seems really awesome so far, even though we haven't seen any gameplay footage as of this point. But so far it seems pretty cool. I think it's like an ambitious style kind of game. So I'm looking forward to the release of this game and I'm really looking forward to some official gameplay because the trailer that we got from the Pokemon Day Pokemon Presents didn't give us any gameplay footage. This is just a reveal trailer. But with that being said, I have a major concern about this game that may or may not make it a very successful game or an unsuccessful game. So if you don't know already, it's apparently going to take place only in Lumio City. Like pretty much only within the city, which is kind of unlike any other Pokemon game because usually a city is just a part of an entire map. And now the, it won't be small, like the map isn't going to be small necessarily. So basically they would, it would be taking place only in the city, but the map would be built to be the same size as like the Paldea map, for example. Like that's, that's just kind of like a quick reference or kind of way to think about the map because you may think that if it's just in a city, it may be small, but they, it would be expanded upon because it would be more of a like true to life size style map if that makes any sense so my main concern with that is how will it look and how will we find new pokemon wild pokemon i'm sure they're gonna allow us to explore outside of the city just a little bit i'd assume we'd probably be able to like hopefully like swim across a body of water maybe to a different wildlife wildland area but my biggest concern is I hope the game is colorful. I'm afraid that it's going to look just so gray and dull because it's only in a city. And there are definitely going to be some colors like with flowers and stuff and like lights and everything. But overall, like they have to make it good looking if we're going to be in the city for a majority of the game. Because as humans, we just don't want to be surrounded by dullness, you know, colorless things all the time and it's gonna kind of turn a lot of people off to the game if it's not super interesting with the colors and stuff i know it's not the biggest deal as long as the gameplay is good and i, I really do hope the gameplay is good i'm i'm gonna assume it's it will be because i believe that the pokemon company and game freak i believe they're listening to the fans and i kind of talked about this in my last video so if you want to check that one out just check it out it's one right before this video I just really hope that they can somehow incorporate a lot of colors within like the buildings and stuff. Obviously they're not too colorful because if it's too colorful, it'll look a little corny or cheesy, but I definitely just don't want it to be extremely gray. And I have two screenshots here. So this one, I could not find the original source, but I saw it in a YouTube video from a creator named Ruffled Rowlet. So I don't know if he made this or not. I just got the screenshot from his video, but this is a fan made screenshot or fan made gameplay of what of what they believe legend za will look like and it's extremely gray and dull and industrial looking which i don't think is the way that game freak the pokemon company should go with this game i really i'm 100 percent down though for it taking place mainly in lumio city i think that's really cool and i think that's a really neat idea and i i think it could be really really interesting to see how this is because it's different than any other pokemon game that we've ever had it could also kind of be like how Legends Arceus is, where you have your your homeland. I forgot what what it's called, but your your home little city area, and then you could explore an entire map of just wildlife. So that's probably what it's gonna be like. They may give us like a new like sub side type of region next to the Kalos region, or that connects to it, or something like that, and call it something different, where we go out and explore Pokemon just like we did in Legends Arceus. So that would be pretty neat as well. And obviously, if that is the case, there will be a lot of side quests and random missions to do out there. So we're not going to only be in Lumio City, but I believe that Lumio City is going to be just kind of like the main, the main hub where we're going to pretty much spend the most of our time. And here's another screenshot of another fan made, you know, gameplay. Um, and this is a lot more colorful. It's at nighttime. But there's like some neon lights. I think this is a lot better than the first screenshot because it just seems more like full of life even though it is pretty industrial looking still at least there's colors and there's like some blue in here i think this is more i think this is more so the style that they're gonna go with at least i really hope it is but at the end of the day as long as it's a really compelling and good storyline with good gameplay good graphics good animations i think the game's gonna be good and i I really hope it's going to change a lot of people's opinions about recent Pokemon games and how they're not fun. I know a lot of people complain that they're not 
the original style where you're kind of just going in a linear direction and everything and that it's open world now but i feel like a majority of the people actually really really enjoy open world games and we really only have a couple of open world pokemon games at this point i mean pretty much every single pokemon ever made is like that linear style so it's not like we have a shortage of the original ish style of pokemon game i think they're going in a good direction here so Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what your thoughts are about Legends EA. Are you excited? What are you looking forward to? What are your concerns about it? Please make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.